Hello everyone, James Preen from EFI again with a quick uh, video here. Um, right now what I want to show you guys is um, how you can set up a automatic backup using Fiery System Restore. <clears throat> so on FS200 and above on most Fiery's um, there is a, the ability to set up a automatic uh, backup and while it's not the best backup that you should have because it does store it on the fiery hard drive thus if the hard drive crashes you lose it it is one that runs automatically you set a date and a time um, and then it just runs so uh, it is a, at least a, an automated backup and you can launch it straight from web tools which is what I'm going to show you now first you gotta do is you know talk to your customer let them know what you're doing explain to them why uh, and make sure that you know two things one <clears throat> that the time and the that you pick is a time when um, there's no production going on and the fiery has to be on in order for the backup to run so just get those things established first and then what you do is you go to the fiery or um, actually any PC that's connected on the network and you know open a browser and punch in the IP address of the fiery and that brings you up to to web tools um, and I've already done that here, so if I just click on my uh, my Google browser, <clears throat> you'll get this warning that this is only because the certificate hasn't been authenticated yet. All right, and here we are. So if you're on a system that has Fiery System Restore, you'll know it because you'll see these two little arrows right here. Okay, if you're logged into a system that doesn't have it, then you can't run the automatic backup. But if I click on this. Uh, because I am on a system that has Fiery System Restore. Uh, this is an FS300. You see I have an automatic backup. And to schedule, all I got to do is click here. I got to log in with my normal login. Admin Fiery.1. And then this will bring up saying, okay, you want to enable it? When do you want to do it? Well, I pick Mondays because uh, Tuesday... Everywhere around the world on Tuesday, Windows patches come out. So I want my backup uh, to happen the day before Windows. So in case Windows crashes something, I can always restore from a backup prior to the Windows patch. And then, you know, again, the time you pick here is relevant to the customer's operation and production if they run multiple shifts. <clears throat> and again, the fire has got to be on. And then I just click Save. And then what happens is now this is scheduled to run a backup. All right. So that's how you make an automatic backup. Um, I'm going to cover some other things in this Fiery Backup uh, System Restore in another video. Um, all right, hope that helps. Thanks, guys. Take care.